I'm Stefan Kruger, um, helicopter pilot, chief pilot for Albatross Aviation in Kenya. Um, we started our company in 2017 when uh, this 407 arrived. And uh, since then we've done 2,200 hours with her. We are pilots because we like to fly. We don't want to be spending time on the ground. So I know with my machine, I'm going to do 150 hours. Then for the next couple of days, she's in maintenance. When she comes out, I'm good for 150 hours again. So she's reliable. That is what uh, one of my main things with her. If I need a spare part, I will have it within two or three days. It is not a, a long stretch out process where my machine will sit on the ground. They will source parts and I get very good aftermarket support from from Bell. Um, I like the speed of the 407. It's a really, really fast helicopter, very comfortable. With the four bladed system, you've got also minimal vibration and uh, excellent medivac helicopter, what we do get a, quite a bit of requests from as well. For medivacs, uh, you want a machine that is very fast. Um, every minute counts, uh, where the 407 then can make quite a, quite a big difference from the other machines. It's a fast helicopter. To convert her into a medivac uh, configuration will take me not more than five minutes. Um, you've got your, you can have two passengers on top of each other on the left hand side. We remove the left hand side uh, seats and your stretcher slide in there. And then as you can see, she's got a big door on the side which can completely open up to load the stretcher in with the patient. So it's very comfortable for the, for the medic also to sit in the helicopter with his back in front of him or by under the stretcher and then with the patient right next to him and very comfortable, same height, easy to monitor and uh, they prefer the 407 more than the other machines. You know, we do a lot of tourism. Kenya is a beautiful country. With the high visibility windows like what she's got on, and each passenger got a, a window seat. Um, your whole, all the people in the helicopter get a great bird's eye view of the landscape and what there is to see. Um, you know, we operate in, in very remote areas in Kenya and uh, we do help people. And that is what makes helicopter flying so satisfying. I think it was in 2019, um, the, the lady was pregnant. A hina attacked the village and they shot the hina and by accident hit the lady in the lake as well. And there was floods in the particular area of Marshabet and uh, I was with some government officials where, which I dropped them off to go and fly the lady to a, to a hospital. And it was a, a very successful story and uh, everyone was very happy. So this particular 407 is very well known in Kenya. On the older machines, um, compared to the G1000, of course, it's a huge upgrade. Um, it, makes, it takes away the pilot workload, makes it more enjoyable. You've got more information. If you know how to use it, it, it assists you in many ways. And uh, in bad weather conditions, um, in operations in the mountains, with the equipment you've got on board, it makes your work, workload much less. In Kenya, um, we have currently got, there's five 407s here, um, and hopefully more, more will come. We're definitely also looking at expanding. It's just a pleasure to fly her, and uh, she's a nice machine. Whoever done a trip with us will, will confess of that. <laughs>